Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Nest. If you are new to the channel, my channel provides a lot of products we view, specifically footwear design. And I also include few different look styling to give you guys an idea to go with the show. In this video, I'm going to do a quick review on this. I think it's very cool show from Nike ACT Mountain Flight Low. Two, I had a very good experience on the Nike Mountain Flight Cortex SE. They look a little bit techy for some, but to me, that shoes fit most of the clothes that I have in my classes because the shoes is black and most of my clothes are black, so they are perfectly matched with most of my clothes. I love the shoes. They are very functional. Uh, they give you a lot of support where your feet need after a long wait finally they released this nike acg mountain flight low 2 i think the low 2 look even better than the first versions don't just judge the yellow colors on the upper of the shoe but just focus on the aesthetic of the shoes they look very nice and clean i know the color yellow may throw up some people but to me like this is the great shoes for me just to do some styling experiments. I think today they released the green colors and the next following weeks, they are gonna release the gray colors. I think those colors, they are safer than this yellow color. I think the yellow color is a little bit challenged for styling why that's what I love, right? I love the challenge on styling with the show. That's why I bought the show. I thought this yellow color would look like the road construction color, but in person, this yellow color look very good. I always thought Nike ACG, they are a little bit more expensive, but this one, the price is only 150. I think it's a great price for this model. I don't know if they use the same shoes last for the first model, but I feel like they are pretty much the same feeling when I put on this show and the fitting on the shoes is fit to two sides for those who have wide feet i would recommend you to go half a side up but i like my shoes to have a snug fit so i think uh, the two two side would uh, fit me very good on this model and let's get a closer up into the design of the shoe the upper of the shoe they used the transparent ripstop material uh, ripstop material as some of you guys may know they are very strong and durable uh, so that's why they use it on this upper and in the bottom of this upper they have the rubberized foxing with the mesh texture uh, this rubberized foxing give me the vibe of the snake's skin and also that wavy design lines on this Rubberized fastings give me that vibe as well. In the lateral size, around the quarter, they have the painted ACT branding logo in black. And in the middle size, they also have the ACT branding, but this one is more like under lace cut out. Uh, that is give it a good touch detail also. And toward to the heel counter, you can see that tiny swoot branding and go to the lacing system for some they are pretty basic but to me i really like the last lace loop created by the shoe lace they are very cool detail there and this last lace loop created by the shoe lace they give you a very good lockdown on the instep on this lace they have the lace locks engraved acg branding logo and at the van they have the elastic lace keeper so if you don't want your lace swinging back and forth, you can tuck this eclet underneath of this elastic lace keeper. On this lace, they have the all conditioning gears text. They give it a little bit extra detail on the lacing system, which is also a very nice touch. Every single tiny detail on the shoes though, when you actually pay attention to it, you will appreciate the shoes even more. And the top of the tongue, they have paddings and this tongue, they actually have gusses. The front and the back, they have the webbing pull for easy on and up with the ACG embodies. 
branding logo. I like the webbing pole that in the back of the heel counter, they are face down. So it gives you a little bit different aesthetic, you know. Often when you look at the webbing pole in the back of the heel counter, they always face up. Another detail that I like about the shoes is this top line in the back around the heel counter. They all kind of exaggerated, thick, give you a better comfort. Um, the only problem with this color though, I feel like they are slightly lower than the regular low top sneakers. If you wear like old socks or you wear the shoe, without socks, I think you're gonna have huge slip on this shoe. I have the same feelings on the Mountain Fly one, which is the ankle colors is really low maybe they just take the dna from the first one and bring it to the second one man let's go to the outsole tooling of the show they are pretty similar to the first model i think the first model they have the asymmetrical toe and this one they are symmetrical toe i love how the outsole extend all the way up to the fam area to give you extra protections around the toe area. On top of this rubberized toe, they engraved the ACG branding logo. I mean, the branding logo, ACG is everywhere. <laughs> the pull tab, the size, the tooling. Now I feel like I, I prefer the Swoot branding logo than the text logo on the show. I don't know, text is just a little bit weird, you know, feel like you are a kid you're trying to learn ABC on the show. That is how I feel when I see so many AC cheap logo on this upper and the tool links. And also in the back of the heel counter, they have that piece like, I think it's TPU heel support. And in the bottom of these outsole tool links, also give me the vibe exactly like the first model, how they execute the painted in the center of this outsole. And in the middle of this outsole, they have the triangle ACG logo. And the midsole, I think they use the Nike flight plate inside of this midsole for a better support. That's why when you are trying to bend the shoes, you can really, yeah, bend it all the way compared to the other regular shoes because they have the Nike flight plate inside of this midsole. Uh, the midsole component that they use, I think the same as the first model, which is uh, the Nike React. And go to the footbed, they actually used the molded socks liner. Uh, overall, I think the shoes is pretty easy to style. I already have some couple looks that I want to try out. I hope you guys like it. So there you go, what you think about this Nike ACT Mountain Flight second model. To me, I love the first model as well as the second model. And what you think about all the looks that I create to go with the shoe. Most of the time when I do styling with the shoes, I just do free styling. 
I'm not really think too much about style lanes, but when it's come with some bright colors, some crazy colors that I don't have it in my classes, it's made gonna keep me a little bit critical thinking. And that's what I like about the style lanes with some challenging, crazy colors, sneaker like this. If you like one of the look in this video or you like the way how I review the show, give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel for more video. I have a lot of video coming up every single week and I can't wait to share with you guys. I'm out.